pili na ukora ndio tumesema ya kwamba jambo la kwanza ili kuhakikisha kwamba yale mambo yaliendelea kule shakahola na ule mtu anaitwa Mackenzie sijui nani ili isirudi ili isifanyike tena katika taifa letu la Kenya tunaweka judicial commission of inquiry so that we can get to the bottom of what really happened in shakahola with the Mackenzie and all his collaborators juzi tuli transfer wale wote ambao walizembea kazini wale commissioners policemen watu wa NIS watu wa CID ambao walikuwa pale maafa ya kiwango ile ikiendelea tumewaambia watoke kwanza ndio tujue what really happened so this week I will be appointing a judicial commission of inquiry so that what happened in Shakahola does not happen again in the Republic of Kenya. Jambo la pili. Nitafanya consultation na viongozi wetu wa dini katika taifa letu la Kenya. Tuwe na task force so that we can weed out the characters who want to abuse religion to run businesses and things that are anti religion in the republic of kenya that we want to provide a framework agreed with our religious leaders a framework that will provide for self regulation so that church so that religion so that our spiritual leaders can have a mechanism where they can point out to government those who want to abuse religion for other purposes so tutaketi chini na wao tutakubaliana so that we can have a task force that is going to help us create a from a framework where we can weed out the people who are abusing religion in our country so nataka niwashukuru sana eh, maskofu wetu kwa kutukaribisha hapa West Pokot. Eh, mujue we are your partners tutafanya kazi pamoja na nyinyi. Hawa viongozi wote wa West Pokot. Eh, mujue ya kwamba serikali ya Kenya